In the Swayambhuva Manvantara, King Suthapas, along with his spouse Prusni, desirous of giving birth to a child, performed penance for 12,000 divine years before the idol of Lord Vishnu, given to them by Lord Brahma. Pleased, Lord Vishnu appeared before them and asked what they wanted. Overjoyed at seeing the true form of Lord Vishnu, he was influenced by the yoga maya of Lord Vishnu and forgot the knowledge of Brahman. Instead of asking for moksha, he prayed three times that Lord Vishnu should bless him with a son equal to him, as he had no children. Thereupon, Lord Vishnu said that there was none equal to him in the infinite universe and that he himself would be born to them three times to destroy the demons and establish dharma. He also said that they would then attain moksha and join him. True to his word, the Lord first manifested as Prusni Garba, son of Prusni and Sutapas. In their next birth, as Kashyapa and Aditi, they received his blessings again, this time as Vamana, the dwarf avatar. Finally, when they were reborn as Vasudeva and Devaki, the Lord graced them with the birth of Sri Krishna, bearing the unmistakable marks of Vishnu himself. This final birth served as a reminder of their unwavering devotion and the promise of liberation fulfilled.